Hello you. WWE 2K Battlegrounds. Obviously the trailer was on yesterday. If you haven't seen my breakdown videos, please go check them out after this one. It'll be in the description possibly as well. Always an end card. You know those fancy YouTube things. But this video is to talk about the similarities between this game and other wrestling games. Two games that you probably are not aware of full stop. So we're going to show you a bit of the trailer again, because the trailer is quite awesome to be honest, even though it didn't really show proper gameplay and only show two second clips of moves, doesn't show me much on it. It has an All-Stars vibe, absolutely, there's no question about that. The big question is, seeing only two seconds of moves, the moves that were in question don't seem to have any chain ability which is what WWE All-Stars has, been able to toggle strikes into grapples and stuff. That doesn't look to be the case for this game with this trailer. I'm hoping that will change and that we actually see some in future videos. So there's two games that instantly came to mind. One of them was not released ever because THQ went bust before it happened, basically. The short version, there's a, there's a much longer version when it comes to it. The other game isn't even a WWE wrestling game, but it did come out on the Xbox 360. Ooh, I know, try and figure it out. I'm gonna show you in a few more seconds. Bear in mind, if you pre-order uh, WWE 2K Battleground, you'll be able to get the rated R superstar as well as an available character. Ooh, yeah, I know, it's quite, it's quite, 35 pounds, 39 dollars, you know, it's not huge price points either when it comes to it. The first game is WWE Brawl. Now, like I say, this never got released, uh, they put footage out a few years ago and you can see with the fighting style open areas it was a lot of destructible environments this game had really good potential as an arcade sort of smash bros type um power stone type game you know it was it looked to be the part um but this was only alpha footage if not even alpha pre-alpha footage and it wasn't to do with pinfalls or submission it was all to do with damage once you got them down to zero that was a knockout and it was all based in this Brawl City, and they were going to have nice storylines and everything for it. It was a nice cartoon arcade game that showed a lot of promise, but never came into fruition. And I'm sad, real sad about it. Boom, Jawbreaker. Yeah, go Miz, it's your birthday. Strikes, combos, everything like that. Oh, and an elbow pissed. Elbow pissed, elbow fist. Fist drop with Miz's mechanical hands. Yeah, he's a businessman. The other game was Fire Pro Wrestling on the 360. Not the same Fire Pro Wrestling that you know on PS4. This was an Xbox Live Arcade title, and it used your Xbox Live avatar, which means you could have some brilliant... Um, there was a lot of Xbox Live costumes you could have for your avatars over the years, and they came straight onto the game, which was awesome. However, the game was absolute peach. But you can see the effects, the fires, the special effects when they fall on the ground and that sort of nature it looks very much like battlegrounds in that respect i'm not saying it's carbon copy or anything but when you see familiarities with certain moves um the strikes and system it just it feels like that Ooh, giant swing the problem with fire pro was there was no moves it was literally one move for the ground grapple couple moves and the, it, there wasn't huge options and it was great to do taunts and stuff and yeah different things it's been so long since i played this i only ever made one video on the channel and that was about eight years ago i haven't remembered it since then and apart from that it had the potential it just never got updated if they kept continuing with it i think it would have been a nice xbox live arcade game there was hit detection issues there was loads of things wrong with it but my 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 trepidation is battlegrounds could have this sort of problem hit detection because we haven't really seen mortal opponents or moves being interfered with or anything like that it looks a little clunky from the trailer with the strikes so i'm kind of worried that that might happen like fire pro and i don't want that to happen i want an all-stars remake i really do what other games do you think um, Battlegrounds has similarities with? I know um, someone's told me um, it, it feels like the Def Jam Vendetta games and Fight for New York. Does it feel like anything else? Let me know in the comment section below. I did a Shining Wizard for the win. It's good. More Battlegrounds footage to come up 
sooner rather than later. We'll see you soon. Take it easy. Subscribe and turn notifications on. Bye-bye.